Hello again, and welcome to SCLC TV. I'm Maynard Eaton, and of course, our president and CEO, Dr. Charles Steele Jr. We're here in Atlanta at Super Bowl week. Uh, and Dr. Steele, you met with some Super Bowl officials this week because two businessmen came to you to talk about meeting with the NFL because they're disgruntled about black vendors not getting their fair share, they allege. Yeah, absolutely, the black vendors uh, approached us, and uh, we also sat with them as well as representatives of the NFL, and that's, that's, that's what we do. We bring folks together. That's what Dr. King was all about. So people won't get out to try and destroy and rather than build. And you can easily uh, uh, dismount something, but it's very difficult to build something and erect something. You can knock something down within a matter of few minutes, but it takes years and years to build something. So that's what we're about building. And I have to say that we did have both sides at the table. I was going to say that meeting with both sides at the table was rather contentious at times, but you served as a bridge builder there, did you not? I, I, I've been trying to do that and, and been exposed to doing that because it was very intense and and that's to be expected people on both sides want to do what's right I feel that we were dealing with but it's a process and an approach to it and that's when SCLC has the mechanism and the training to bring folks together and I think we left there and and in uh, future meetings we will be more uh, in tune and impactful in bringing about a harmonious working relationship are you hopeful that something will come out of this? Uh, SCLC will kind of forge a business relationship with the NFL? That I'm very hopeful in terms of the entrepreneurial spirit and to commend uh, the entrepreneurial uh, community here in Atlanta for understanding that uh, I, I was real hard on both sides, not just one versus the other, because we should have been at the table a year and a half ago, man. You yeah, know this that. was the 11th hour. The 11th hour, and then, you know, I thank God that everybody trusted SCLC and my leadership to try to resolve this matter. But we should have been at the table a year and a half ago. But you think there's fruit? You said it was low-hanging fruit this year. Yes. But there's fruitful opportunities down the road. That's a Super Bowl every year. That's right. And we can't get stuck in just on one Super Bowl. So that's where we are. That's where we're uh, headed in terms of our negotiation. We still got to get there, but we're much further than we were a week ago. Speaking of the Super Bowl, what impact do you think it have on Atlanta and the Southeast? I mean, are you happy that the Super Bowl's here in your, the headquarter town of SLC? I think um, many times we as local community persons, citizens, elected officials don't understand the Im impact of events. Mm -hmm. And you have to get unstuck about being comfortable. You can do whatever you want to do in the world. Mayna, let me bring this to your attention. Do you know they're going to build an uh, infrastructure of events with the Super Bowl in full? games that's going to be played in London, England, not in New York, not in my, Miami, the next Super Bowl is in Miami, but I'm talking about games in, yeah. on foreign turf, in foreign territory. My question is, entrepreneurs around America, not just in one particular city, what are we going to do? Are we going to get involved or get stuck? You can get stuck in a comfort zone in just your community, or are you willing to have vision and expand? This is business, my brother, and it's civil rights business for us. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, our president, our CEO, a Super Bowl kind of champion guy himself, I'm Maynard Eaton. This is with SCLC TV. <laughs>